building. The Flying Elvites are back and shaking things up on today, the anniversary of Elvis Presley's death. We want to welcome to the show. Tommy, you've been here for quite a bit. Yeah, I seem to be a regular here. How'd you become such an Elvis fan? Basically, as a musician, his approach to the music combining gospel, rhythm and blues, and country, and being the first to innovate that has changed American culture, and he's put a landmark as one of the greatest musicians and entertainer of our time. Attila, we've seen you for the first time sing today. What's your Thank favorite you. Elvis song? Well, I did pick the 50s, so I like uh, you know, Don't Be Cool, which is a, one of the basic uh, 50s songs. And Philip, you're a guitarist, you're an actor, and actually into martial arts, too. Elvis was in all three of those things. Is that yes. by design? That by design? Who do you think? Thank you very much. Thank you. There you go. Of course it is. <laughs> the Elvites are in the house, folks. I'm going to step out of the way. Take it away. Don't be cruel to what is true. Don't be cruel. All right, still to come on the morning news. Don't sleep well, long. I'm going to show you the new boyfriend pillow ahead. But first, more from the Flying Elvites. They're going to perform at Abra Restaurant tonight at 7 p.m. You can log on to our website for more information. Elvites, have a great day. We'll see you again tomorrow. are getting all shook up for Elvis's birthday. From Graceland to our studio, the Flying Elvises, or the Elvites. It's all coming up in the next hour of the WB11 Morning News. Back to John. And they are in the blessed conversation. The Flying Elvites are getting ready to perform the King's Classics live in our studio. News from Graceland to our studio, the Flying Elvites. Stay with us. January 8th, tomorrow's Elvis' birthday. Elvites are in the house. Happy birthday, Thank you very much.
today. We're celebrating. Tomorrow would have been Elvis Presley's 70th birthday, and the Elvites are back to remember the king and perform for us. Perform for us. Welcome back, guys. Thank you, Always good to have you in the studio. How did you guys everyone. get into impersonating Elvis? Well, you know, we uh, always were big fans of him in the 50s, uh, from the 50s and 60s, and uh, we had to comb the hair like that, and we just sang like that, and then it came out. It was cool. It was what are your cool. favorite Elvis songs? Well, <coughs> it's a great honor to pay tribute. Greatest entertainer of all time, right? Favorite uh, I would say is, uh, <laughs> thank you very much, but uh, Suspicious <laughs> Minds, yeah. And do, you, do you observe his birthday? Do you guys do anything John, special? John, thank you for having us on the show. Um, it's not only a celebration of his birthday, but it, uh, it's a celebration of a great entertainer, a great human being, and a, a celebration of the American dream, which is alive in all of us. Well, it's going strong, guys. Thanks so much. We're going to hear you sing. I'm going to give you some more information, though. You can contact Dynasty in Entertainment, and that's at 732-985-7557. You can see the Elvites before Monday night here in Manhattan. Guys, take it away. Sugar. Give them the answer real quick. The first national T uh, Elvis appeared on what national show? Lynn? Stage. There you go. Nice job, Lynn. All right, coming up at 8 o'clock, the future live from Las Vegas. We'll be right back. Stay with us.